Valentine's Day is almost here, and what better way to celebrate than with cookies? Our Nine News Executive Director of Social Responsibility and Community Affairs, Jesse Ogus, is here with us right now. Thanks for coming in. Thanks for having me again. Always great recipes. <laughs> what are we cooking up today? So these are called uh, Mexican wedding cookies. We call them punuelos. Mm -hmm. And so they're, what's interesting is throughout Latin America, everybody has their own little version, right? My mom used to make these during the Christmas season. So she used to call them St. Nick's and she would roll them up in little crescents. And so it's really, really easy for folks to make. So I thought, let's feature this. Mom and, and, and dad can work with the kids tonight and make a quick batch of cookies. All right. It's really simple. It's a stick and a half of butter. Healthy. That's all you need. <laughs> <laughs> with you had five, me at butter. <laughs> with five <laughs> tablespoons of powdered sugar, which is this guy, with a cup of pecans, and of course my homemade oh, uh, vanilla course. extract. Mm -hmm. It's a tablespoon. And so really all you do is you cream the butter, you cream the powdered sugar, the five tablespoons, and a tablespoon of vanilla. And then to top it all off, you add more sugar. <laughs> Well, Perfect. <laughs> well, well, then you take the mix, you put it in your flour, you mix it up, mm -hmm. and then you, you um, add your pecans at that time. So you mix it, and it's going to be like a, like a paste almost. Mm -hmm. You get a, a tablespoon, and you just scoop it out, and you lay it on your pan. So it's really easy, and I left one for you here. So this is what it'll look like when it comes out of the oven. You want it nice and golden brown. And then what you do, once it cools, mm -hmm. you dump it in the powdered sugar, <laughs> so. I knew more sugar was coming. All right. Put that bad boy in there. And Ooh. then you roll it. This is so much fun for the kids. I mean, maybe not fun for parents clean up <laughs> afterwards, but great for the kids. And they taste delicious. They're simple, it's easy. You cook them for 20 minutes at 375 in the oven or until they're golden brown. Like I said, let them sit. Drop them in there. All you need is a uh, slightly greased cookie sheet, and you're ready to go. Simple. Do you remember making these like as a child? Oh, I do. Every Christmas time was really fun because we made bizcochitos, mm -hmm. which we've done before, um, and then we made the what my mom called Saint Nick's. Um, come to find out, they're really Mexican wedding cookies. Yeah. But like I said. Every culture within Latin America has their own version. Everyone adds a little bit of something, something. They do. I mean, look at you with your homemade vanilla. There I mean, we go. wow. And you know what? And I always tell people if you're going to use vanilla, don't use imitation. What? Smell that bad boy. Yeah, you got to do it upright. That's, that's really do strong. Do vanilla good. extract. That's the best way to go. Well, this is so great. Your mom was quite the cook. She was. Well, you know, she, um, she raised six of her siblings. Her mom passed away from cancer oh when she goodness. was 12 years old. So she was the oldest. And so she had to raise these little kids and learn how to cook. She had Mama Rita, she called her, her grandmother. She taught her how to cook from a very young age. And so, like I said, at age four, I remember peering over the counter, <laughs> watching her. And, you know, to this day, I, I hold dear all those uh, traditional recipes. Yeah. And I'm the only one that could, does it in my family. Well, I'm so glad that she gave you all the recipes <laughs> and you're handing them down to us, which is so great. Love the family recipes. Jesse, thank you so much for coming in. Thank you. Happy Valentine's Happy Day. Happy Valentine's Day. Yay. Now I can eat cookies. I'll bring you one, Jordan. Don't you worry. <laughs> They're good. <laughs>